Hello everyone, welcome to Built From Bricks. I'm Brian. And I'm Drew. And we are talking Lego, Lego news today. Yeah, it's been a while since we've talked about anything new with Lego as far as news. And there's so much stuff coming out. I'm, it's unbelievable. I saw one post that said there's over 100 sets coming out in 2018. That's insane. And so I wanted to talk about a few of them. I and mean, we're looking at some of the stuff here on the screen here. And I think one of the things that I was excited for is Lego Movie 2. Lego Movie 2. The second part. Yes. And it's <laughs> such an original name. Well, the second part, you have one Lego. Yeah, and here's your here's second, your second part. part. Mm. So I thought that was cool. It, they haven't given an, an exact date when it's coming out. But February 2019 is the date, is the month. Well, you got 28 possible days. Yeah, and um, Will Arnett's coming back. <laughs> Good. Mm. And uh, Elizabeth Banks is coming back. And then there's some new people. Of course. I don't know who Tiffany Haddish is, but she's a new role. I do not know who that Could is. Could be related to the Duplo stuff, perhaps. You know, maybe it's a Duplo. Because I, I, I imagine they're going to put Duplo in this. And that's, you know, if you remember the ending of the first movie, it's, you know, the kid comes with the... Right. It's all the Duplo stuff. It's all the Mixels. It's things like that. Yeah. So that's really exciting. I'm excited for it. I asked my son if he wanted to do a birthday party at the movie theater, and he wasn't that excited about that. So we'll see. And what else do we have? There's a ton of stuff coming up. One thing that I think that you might like is they keep teasing this title, and I'll, I'll tell you the tease, which is, and you'll see it here in a second on the screen, is Chaos is Coming. Hmm, Chaos. You haven't heard about this, have you? I have not. I so have they're not. making a DC Supervillains Lego game is what the... Really? Yes. Oh, okay. That sounds cool. And he's a huge comic fan. I love so comic books, yeah. I figure he would be one that'd be really excited about that. I don't know much about it. They haven't... They've... I don't even know if there's a trailer or anything for it yet. Well, I, I mean, from the from the image, you can kind of tell some of the people, you know, there was, you've got the Riddler, the Chaos is Coming, that's the Joker, definitely. Yeah. I think the... Um, and it's coming in, does that mean five months, 19 days, 35 hours, and 40 minutes, or what? Possibly. They posted the timeline of when it's coming out, I'm guessing. Yeah. Or is that five days, 19 hours, you know, five months or five days? It's the first I've heard about it. I'd say five months. Yeah, you know? I don't know. Probably, you know, maybe yeah. the, um, it says a countdown time or set to end. Oh, no. Oh, Wednesday Wednesday next week? Week? Oh, wow. All right, five days. Wow. wow. That might, that may just tell us what's what's coming it might be just a trailer for it because i can't imagine that all oh, suddenly it's the game um, yeah but there's know. a lot of the, there's a lot of the super villains that you're gonna like you know, there's lex luther oh, yeah. and there's well the sinestro with that, yeah you got a whole bunch you got i'm not as up, as up on top of the <laughs> dc side of things the flash is there though he's not a villain but no but there's the a, reverse flash there's the reverse flash yeah. i see him in the picture yeah so solomon grundy you know the cat, cat woman actually if we could just spin off for a second here uh, next season on the DC shows, there's going to be Batwoman. So she's she's been uh, talked about as coming to the new the the like the Flash, the uh, Arrow, Supergirl. Like when they do the big crossover that they've done in the past couple of years with the four different shows, they're gonna uh, introduce Batwoman. Oh, nice. So, yeah. We I also saw that there's some sets coming out and there was a Batwoman set too. Yeah. Haven't seen much about it. I didn't read too much into it, but there's there's so much stuff coming out. One of the other things that just came out that I thought was really cool and I was excited for... Well, actually, I'm not excited about this one. This is the... It just... They're funny. The Unikitty minifigure series. Okay. So I think there's 12 of them. All I right. forget. They're blind bags. And the problem with the, the these, they all have the same. Unless they have an accessory with them, mm. it's going to be very difficult for you to figure out what's in a bag. Yeah, that's going to be tough. And you're going to end up with duplicates. They trade them would be the best thing if you want them. Yeah. I mean, I think that would be I mean, be there cool. are some... looks like some characters don't look like Unikitty, at least from this, this image for this uh, on the Cartoon Network, where they're going to have a show. The, um, yeah, the show starts you know, in, what, August, I believe? Uh, yeah, and the yeah. minifigures come out in June. Oh, okay. Sometime in June. One other thing that's coming out in June, and I don't know if you mentioned this, was the... It's a promotion. If you spend $199 or more after... It's either June 1st or June 4th. I don't want to say the wrong date. But it's a storybook, the pop-up storybook oh, Lego yeah. set. Have you seen that? And you've talked about it, and I have not seen it. So let's I, post I a picture here, and, okay. they can, and they can see it. It's it's really cool because it's basically you get this book here, you, and you can see, and then the, the the scene comes out of the book. It just it's awesome. Oh, that's really cool. So nice. That was another exciting thing. Yeah. The 
one of my favorites. I missed out on this. Is I think it's a lot of people's favorites. The first time around, yeah, I missed out on this too. I didn't buy any of them. Harry Potter. Yes. So we have Harry Potter, and I've already heard people complaining that they didn't like the look of some of the things, such as the Whomping Willow. And here's the Whomping Willow. Yeah. I think it looks it's fine. I mean, it's it's it wasn't a pretty tree to begin with. It's very sticky. It's very you know what they call it, leggy when there's this like straight branches like that. Yeah. So it's got the the Fort Anglia in the center of it, and Ron and, and Harry, just a typical Harry Potter scene from what? Sure. That, um, that was episode the, two. No, it was um, the third. It was the first episode. First, second, or third I movie? First, third, 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 third movie. Yeah. The one that looks really cool is, and I don't care too much for the. They do have the brickheads. They do have brickheads, and you know the double door looks pretty cool. But the one that I'm excited for is is the tra- is this one here, which is the the train. The train. The Hogwarts okay. Express, and it has yeah. a lot of minifigures with it. It seems like too. Yeah. And you also oh, have the Quidditch, cool. the Quidditch set, mm-hmm. which is another really cool one. So, the Quidditch set, it's basic, it's a playable set, it's for kids, but if you want, sure. I'm sure people, and I think I've seen them before, there's been mocks for that already, but at least this gives you the, the four Quidditch, the towers for the four houses, and... Yeah, that's cool. And then I think, there was one thing doesn't interest me, but I know a lot of kids and girls, I think, like this show, is Powerpuff. So there's a bunch more Powerpuff sets coming out in August. I'm not familiar with the figures. There's Buttercup and Bubbles and Blossom. I don't know much about them. Yeah, I, I mean, I got them for Le- Lego Dimensions. Exactly. And that's, that's it. And I really, I don't believe I even played them. I've never actually watched the show, um, at, or the or the rebooted show. So. And the final thing, and this one's this one I'm not familiar with at all, but it's a. What do you want to call this when you join up with another team? With another company, Would, uh, not a merger. Cross promotion? No, or... they're they're teaming up with. They're, they're getting the they're getting the rights okay. to this computer game. Yeah. Basically, um, well, it's Blizzard. Yeah. The... So Blizzard makes StarCraft, World of Warcraft, and a ton of other games. One of the games that apparently has been around for two years but is very popular is Overwatch. Hmm. And I don't know Overwatch. You can see here is a picture of the Overwatch. What they look like in the game, I'm assuming. I don't play the game. I'm gonna have to yeah. see what it's all about. Like I, heard... I have a T-shirt. Of Winston, uh, is Winston from Overwatch? Like, yeah, yeah, he's the he's the um, the gorilla. Uh, so you know, and then it looks like too. And I'm not sure about this. We were reading. Well, Blizzard has a ton of stuff, which leaves yeah. it open if they're working with if Lego's working with Blizzard. Well, the Warcraft would be pretty cool. Sure, I can see that they have here mentions Crash Bandicoot, Spyro, and well, World of Warcraft. Uh, well, Warcraft was done by Mega Blocks. They was it in Halo? You know, but I don't know. Oh, if Halo's yes. not but maybe Halo's they don't have Blizzard. the maybe they don't have the well, maybe not the license the because they're talking on. here that you know they're they're doing right now it's like the licensing expo it's in in, in Las Vegas and so they're talking about those these different things and uh, be, you know while you're at that they actually find out some different things uh, a lot of spoilers for stuff too because mm-hmm. of all the different uh, licenses that are coming you know, yeah. And, but anyway, um, so, what so, I want to know, yeah, are there going to be any space sets? You know, people have been asking for classic space sets forever. Hmm. Spaceship! And I, I just had to throw that in there. But <clears throat> we, who, all, who loves Benny? And Benny's got to be back in the yeah. in the final. Oh, good. In the second movie, he's got to be. Oh, I can't yeah. imagine they would not put Benny back yeah. in. I mean, they'll have a lot of they'll, they'll have the favorites back in the in the in the Lego movie. Yeah, so space is one that people are asking Lego for. It doesn't seem like they're budging on it. Maybe they will. Maybe they'll bring mm-hmm. back classic space. Maybe they'll make a new space line. I don't think the Alien one did too well. The Alien Conquest stuff. Yeah. Like Galaxy, whatever it was called. I'm still finding those at Toys R Us. Like I, I was reading somewhere that they're just pulling out whatever they have back in those storerooms. Oh, yeah. Like, I've been looking for stuff. But junk this... just from way, way back. Not that Lego stuff is junk, but like... You, you could get some of those Alien Conquest stuff at 15% off. I, I just think. saw... No, they're 30% for Lego off now. Really? Is there but anything left? Not really. No, I was gonna not say, much. This I was going to go by today, too. If you're I missing, could... like, the Quake mech, they have that, and that's 30% off. Oh, so you'd really? Save 30, you'd save almost 30 bucks on that. That's a cool-looking mech. I love they that have giant the giant tire. The Nij- yeah, the Ninjago tire set. The Ninjago... Okay. Not tire. I'm saying tire. <laughs> <laughs> The Ninjago, <laughs> what do you call it? The temple, that smaller oh, temple. Yeah. That's there, thirty percent off. So there's, I mean, there's some. There's some things. There's some okay. things there, not mm-hmm. much. It's sad yeah. that they're closing. Yeah, but I waited too long. I wanted to get the, uh, I wanted to get the Voltron uh, toys. 
Oh. Uh, like, the actual toys. Not the Voltron set. Do we know a date for the Voltron nope, set? No, I haven't heard anything. I heard it actually might have been pushed back. Really? Yeah. That's I, something I read quickly. I didn't mm. go deep into it. I hope it doesn't, because I did have, really want that. Yeah, they had, they had um the... It was Mega Bloks, but the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the big ball... It looks kind of yeah. like a Death Star. They have yeah, that the there at 30% off, because... Nobody bought it apparently yeah. when it was out because I'd never seen that on the shelf oh, until yeah. now. It was almost like two hundred dollars when it you know to, to, to buy it to be at first. Oh, so now it's probably two twenty marked down thirty percent. So you might get it for one sixty. <laughs> I don't know. I, and at, at older um, Toys R Us that that um, you know liquidated sooner, that went all the way down to like sixty dollars. So really, you can wait on that one. I don't think a lot of people are really going to be picking that one up. It's got a ton of pieces and and stuff and be kind of cool, but. They're, I mean, Toys yeah. R Us is selling shopping carts yeah. now. They're $35 a piece if you want a shopping cart. Really? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know what I would do with one, but it'd be cool to have to a Toys R Us shopping cart. I guess cart. you could make it into a go-kart. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Find the best one they got. Like, I want this. 30% yeah. off. It's 35 bucks, I mean. 35 bucks. They're selling, like, the back office supplies. I mean, the people are going to be working there and have no lunchroom because someone bought their table because they're selling everything. They're selling everything. Yeah, yeah I haven't been back in a while. It is sad. It's sad, but that's not all just Lego and... We're talking Lego here, and that was our little Lego review news update. Since we haven't done one, we're gonna have to n maybe a new segment where we do this more often. Yeah. And then, as you know, instead of just the reviews, talking about what's coming up and some other like kind of hands-on type of thing. This is almost like a live show, not live, because we're talking to the camera like you're watching us now, and you're watching this saved. Yeah. So. <laughs> Well, thanks for watching, and don't forget to check us out on YouTube and Instagram and Twitter and Facebook at Built From Bricks, as well as our sister site, The Bricks Hub. They do lots of kind of news and funny Lego memes as well, and you see them on Facebook as well as TheBricksHub.com. And here, as it says below on the bottom, every Thursday at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and we can't forget about Benny. Spaceship! <laughs> thanks for watching. What have... You, you built, built today. today.